Hello YouTube, this is Charter Yu-Gi-Oh! here with a box of about 6,000 commons. I've been counting through these all night, I've been through those boxes already, and I still have all those up there to go through. But, I finally decided to start moving some of my bulk, I put a lot of thought into that. And I'm going to talk about why I think that's a good idea, so I'm going to stop this video and come right back. So, I think getting rid of bulk is a pretty good idea. I know a lot of people hold on to it and hoard it because there's always those commons and hollows and stuff that just shoots way up whenever new support is released. But, at the same time, that only happens to one out of probably... 200 cards, I don't know, but it's very unusual that that happens and even then you're not guaranteed that you're gonna have any of those commons and rares that do go up. It works out fantastic, I mean it's like winning the lottery when it does, but those are also cards that you have sitting there that aren't working for you. So if you sell your bulk off to say Troll and Toad, trade it in, you get some money, you can use like... That money, like I said, I had that box over there is like 7,000 commons, which comes out to like $90 or so on Troll and Toad or something like that. So that's a lot of money that you can be putting into other decks or cards that you might want or just lots of other things. And I don't like having cards, if you view them as resources, I don't like having them just sitting there not doing anything for me. If I can use, just trade in that resource that otherwise would be just sitting there, I can use that to buy more binders, buy more cards, buy sleeves, buy whatever, and just keep stuff moving. Like, if I have a huge pile of commons and rares that just stagnates, then I'm not getting anything for that. That's a lot of value in my collection that's not doing anything for me. I'd rather have it have that value in a trade binder where I can maybe plus on trade a little bit, or put it in a deck where I can use it to win tournaments. Or I just don't like having resources just sitting around not doing anything. So that's how I feel about it. Obviously, everyone does their own things with their bulk. I had one kid who used to go to my locals who would make custom deck boxes out of common cards. And they were really cool deck boxes. And they held together really well. And he sold those for a bit. And I don't know what he's doing now. But I thought that was a really cool idea. So... If you have your own use for your common cards or you just like having tens of thousands of cards sitting around. I mean, I had over 120,000 cards at one time. And since then, I've been cutting that back significantly, especially because I live in a dorm room now. But just post what you do with yours down below. And if you think it's a good idea to sell it, because honestly, I'd just rather move it. And if uh, there's like, say, five cards in there that do go up... Then I still moved a ton of absolutely worthless commons and just got rid of them. And no one says you have to sell off everything. So just post what you think down below and peace out YouTube.